Hi everyone, welcome. I have a fantastic workout plan for us today. We have our low impact weights and I've got a core opener because we do want to engage on that core, especially if we're doing any kind of compound movements. You want to make sure that we're really aware, making that mind muscle connection. This is our low impact option today. So this is great for permanent friendly if you want to go easy on your joints. And we're still going to rev up that metabolism because we're working uh, at, at uh, non-stop movements and also working the legs, the upper body at the same time while using the core. Now don't get uh, um, confused with low impact meaning easy because we are definitely putting the effort into this workout. We're going to get the music started here. If you're joining me live, drop a comment. Let us know that you're joining us. If you're doing this workout at a later date, drop a comment. Let us know how the workout's going. If you haven't already, subscribe to my YouTube channel and turn those notifications on so you don't miss a workout. Are you ready? Let's get going. Starting with a lightweight warm-up. Option to bend the knees, neutral spine. 
spine, most important. Three, two, five steps, coming up, palm up, elbow down. Let's go up, down. You want to isolate that bicep, shoulders back. Put the mind into that muscle belly. Tempo, let's go. on the upper body or swinging your arms past your thighs. Full range, most effective. Eight. Now imagine I've placed an Easter egg in between your shoulder blades. Keep it there. Squeeze and hold. Lateral raise. Shoulder abducting out. Low. Down. Together. Wiggle the toes. 
toes. Seven pulses. Let's go. Want to incorporate those legs? Rev up that metabolism. Last two. Last one. Again, seven. Three. Two, fifteen. One time. The lower you go, the harder it gets. Everybody's built differently. Listen to your body. Three legs are burning. Tempo. Let's go. Second round. Spider. Down dog. One spider. Other arm. Check. Down. Walk. Four. Three. Two. Other arm. Walk it up. Showing you three options. Second option is a bear crawl. Bear crawl. Advanced. One play. Not easy. Going two feet for that squat. Again, you you choose. Make sure you got that other arm. Two squats. I love a good core workout, friends. So important. Good for spine health, spine awareness, especially those who sit down for long periods of Keep going. Next round. We hold that spider option. Drop to your knees. Stabilize the hips. Don't worry if you have to go from your knees. I want you to train within your capabilities. Safe, warm, down, up, keep going. Control the movement, one more. Up, walk, single, squat. How are we doing? Permission to take a little break. Drop a comment, even if you're doing this at a later date. Get those fingers working. Let's go. Pulse, three. Whew. Heart rate is elevated. Good. Again, we're moving the whole hour. Take a break. Drop a comment anytime. Pulse, seven. Let's go together. Three. Squeeze your glutes. We're not on autopilot. We're checking in on our form, on our range. 15. Hup, hup. Seven, tummy in tight. Three, two, temple, flush it out. Next track. Option to flip it on your back. Chest press. Option push ups. We're doing two rounds. Option tricep push up. Grab the mat. You want to head down. You want to go incline. I like to give you options. I know lots of you have various pieces of gym equipment. High plank. Again, option on the floor. Push up when you're ready, slow. Down. Up. I've showed you the option, incline on the wall. Keep going. Incline on the wall. Good. You want to keep your hands just almost in line with your shoulders and armpits. You're drawing that arrow with your elbows. Tempo.
four, three, two, nice, forward, and back, give me upper body a little break, second set coming up, option, out a little pulse,
the neurotransmitters grow. Wide growth. Narrow, lunge, down, up, together. Keep going. Little bit of footwork. We want to turn that autopilot off. Mental stimulation as well as muscular. Hold, breathe. Two, lots of core balance here. Find your focal point out in front. Spine neutral, friends. Spinal erectors are engaged. Back, biceps, shoulders. Breath is heavy, three. Two, control the weights. Seven, let's go, let's go. Down, up. Square the hips. Down, up. That's it. Three, two, one, row. Three, two, bring the posture. Seven. Almost there. it. Three, two, you got it. Last time, wide row. Set it up. A modification, alternate those weights. Hollow bone is stable. Watch that eccentric release, get it lift. Down. What is your perceived exertion? tells you if you're working hard or not. For me, my breath is heavy. I've got sweat dripping down my face. Four more, let's go. Set two. Coming up. Collect your thoughts. We can do this. Permission to take a break. Drop a comment. Reverse. Lunge. When you're ready. Wide. Adductors. Glutes. Quads. Back, balance, check your shoulders, row, slight hinge forward, big hinge forward, back knee, check in, get it nice and low, elbows up, keep going, back, down, up, You're rotating your wrists in between narrow and wide row. Hold three. Hop. Two. Right to the navel, friends. Keep going. Hold. Three. Two. One. Take it back. Let's go. Let's go. Wide row. Sweat is dripping. Seven, friends. Up. Modification. Anytime. Three, two, one. Wide. Let's go. Up. Three. We've got this. Two, hang on to it. Lunge. Not easy. Core is engaged. Stabilizes on. Last one. Wide throw. Let's go. Check your spine. Everything neutral. Tummy in tight. One more. Dead lift. Bravo. That's tough. Heavy load. Slow twitch muscle fiber. Going back to the squats. Single squat when you're ready. Now, shake up the arms if you need. I'm going to switch to a lighter load for biceps. Biceps. Eight more. Want to get the legs into the equation? Again, with your larger assets, 
again. Let's go. Pulse three, two. You're stronger than you think. That's why those comments are so key. Not just live comments, but if you've done that workout, drop a comment. People review them. It motivates everybody. One big pool of energy. Seven. Let's go. Stay here. Now check your knees. Are they buckling in? Glutes. Quads. Now I said seven, but I did 15. Last two, last one. 15, last five. Stand to neutral. Shoulders back. Let that oxygen in. Single squats coming up in three, two, flush. Now, up. Pulse is coming up one more time. This time, we add two curls. Keep going. Catch your breath. Two fine grip. Pulse three, two curls coming up. When you're ready, let's go. Three, two, one. Standing tall, then curl. There's no transfer of energy from the legs to the upper body. Posterior pelvic tilt. Squeeze your glutes. Transverse. Neutral hips. Good. Three. Up tall. Up. Again. That's right. Keep going. Again, you're going to feel that in the erector spine here. The cable that runs up the spine. Like the Eiffel Tower, single squat, single curl. Keep going. Sit back, 
squeeze your glutes. Do you see the activation in the glutes? Spine tall. Squeeze. Squeezing my transverse navel toward my spine. Protect that low back. Keep going. Now your chest is facing the screen. But pull the ribs down. Does that make sense? One squat. One curl.
abduction, starting with the legs. Kick it out to the side. So a square hip is truly parallel to this weight here. Again, if you have a step, use the step to keep the hips parallel. Micro bend in that knee, the hip will open slightly. Yes, you want to micro bend in that standing leg. You want to keep all of the quads activated. Now check that toe. I think I just saw my toe go out. You want the glute knee friends. Medial delts. Slow it down. Out. Down. And you know, I can't see the comments, but I trust you guys. Either during the workout or after, we'll all chime in and keep going. For those of you joining at a later date, would love to hear from you. Create that group fitness atmosphere, bring that energy. Tempo, let's do this. Ouch. Those comments encourage me as well. Keep going. Going. Was that a little break? I think so. Eight. Remember, if you don't have that weight, lengthen the levers, go top half, last two, last one, other leg goes up. That's the last standing sequence. We're going to work the posterior chain and more glutes. Eight, four. Tummy in tight. Good. Four, three, two. Nice work. Good. Grab your mats. We're going to start with the side line leg raise. We're going to do a bit of a combo. I'm going to take off my shoes.
Now, if laying lower doesn't activate the glute, come up onto this elbow. Again, your obliques, your core should be engaged. This leg is pressing towards your mat. So you're working both sides of the hips. Are you ready? Pulse. Three. Check your toe. Leading with the ankle. Three, two, one. Great job. Not easy. Singles.
really want you to get, to get used to the glute activation. So you want to squeeze that glute, that posterior pelvic tilt, our pelvis is going to press down to the mat. If you want to take it to one leg up, one leg up. Get used to the glute activation. It's not a back activation. Option. Hold. Cactus arms. And hold. Not about how much you can lift, it's just that you're putting more activation onto your backside. That's all that matters. Back of the hands, back of the thighs. Eight. Glutes on fire here. You should create those dimples in the side of your glutes. Thumbs down. Shoulders lift. Relax your feet. Lots of the blood going to the glutes. Four. Tuck that pelvis under. Lots of cues, but they all matter. Bent elbows. Great exercise for anybody that does compound movements, does any kind of lifting, sits at a desk or drives in a car or slouches on your phone. This is a great exercise to incorporate on a regular basis. Now, did you, did you go anterior? Let's get back to that posterior pelvic tilt. Check in. Thumbs down, hold. Imagine a puppeteer has you by the ankles, the knees, back of the shoulders, back of the head, hands forward. Pressing that pelvis into the mat, using your glutes, Everything on the back side is activated here. Back of the hands. Let's go, let's go. Hold. Option, take eight seconds rest. Maybe you take a whole fifth sixteen. We're going one more time. Little bonus round. In the vault, I have 20-ish, 30-ish minute class of these and push-ups. Overhead, let's go. Seven, six. If you're feeling shaky, that's great. Glutes are on. Bent elbows. No arch in that low back, friends. Posterior pelvic tilt. Squeeze your glutes. Constant reminders on form. It's for success. Let's go. Can you feel this tomorrow? In four. Three, two, last round of eight. Get those triceps back of the shoulders, glutes. Four, three, a well-deserved child pose. Alright, so Swiss 
ball if you have, if you don't. Come into bicycle, come into low plank. This is level one. Don't need a ball. Want to anchor that low back down to the mat and up. Other option. Advanced. Option to bend the knees. You're going to bring the shoulder blades up off the mat. There we go.
roll back, anchor down, let's go. together. Just hang upside down here. Decompression for your spine.
this workout a thumbs up on YouTube, comments both platforms, subscribe to my YouTube channel, share these workouts with friends. If you're finding value in these workouts, let us all know. Share with your friends. It's one big pool of energy. Great. Have a wonderful day. We'll see you again.